Alright there everyone, I thought I would make the obligatory wedding video, here we go, I'm now a married man, wow, and it, here's a black titanium wedding ring, I wish I had better lighting in here because in the sunlight it kind of like shimmers a little bit blue looking, it's not It's not just completely black, anyway, here we go, I'm, I'm married and uh I, I find the subject of weddings really boring. If someone else was making a video like this, I wouldn't watch it. So I don't really expect people to watch it just because, you know, I'm aware of my own disinterest in weddings. But I kind of wanted to make this video anyway, just because, um, I don't know, maybe I'll be able to look back on it one day. If, if this channel stays up for any length of time, doesn't get taken down. Um, and, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll just briefly talk about a wedding because it was quite fun uh, the, the ceremony I just wanted to get that out, out of the way as quick as possible quick civic centre registry office do we have a few people there very nice um, and then um, on to on to Wyland Brewery which was the main event and um, Basically, in in the middle of Exhibition Park in Newcastle, there's, there was an old like it used to be a military vehicle museum, and the building was bought out by Wyland Brewery and turned into a brewery uh, with a a bar attached and a big function hall in the middle. And um, if you haven't been, if you live in the Newcastle area, definitely go and check this place out because it's um, well impressive and. Uh, people were suitably impressed by the venue and um, I'll put some pictures and things on at the end of this um, to show you but basically the venue um, you've got you go into the bar and you've got a wall with a, a line of taps I think it's like 13 taps with different beers in each one straight from the brewery straight from the barrels pumped right through and then uh, they've got other guest guest beers and ciders on draft as well and also a ton of bottled beer in the in the fridges so um, I did sample a great deal of them and uh, got very very merry in the process and uh, that was a very fun night out so um, I don't, know, I don't really know what to say about it because, um, like I say, I don't really. I find I find weddings are boring subjects to talk about uh, or listen to people talk about. So I don't want to make this a, a a video talking about a wedding. I just people might be interested. So um, yeah, it was a, a nice day and uh, yeah, got a got a ring on my finger and uh, so was Alex and. Um, uh, I don't know what else to say really. I was just show the pictures. Um, I don't know if you can see in the pit whether you'll be able to see, but my suit, um, I picked myself. My shirt was um, had magic mushrooms on. I can't believe I got away with wearing a shirt to my wedding with magic mushrooms on it. But um, that's that's the pattern. It from a distance, people were saying it looked like butterflies or something, and they got up close. Oh God, it's mushrooms. So. Um, that was something um, and you'll see Alex looks very nice I'm putting a picture I'm putting these pictures on without anyone's permission um they're basically they're not uh, they're basically just people's photographs from like um Instagram and Facebook that I've nicked um so they're not the official photos in I'm I'm pulling a really gormless face in all of them cuz they're not like the, the, the nice wedding photographs um the only ones that look half decent are the ones that Kogan took because he's he's good at photography and uh, I stole I stole his photos off of Instagram. Um, but you can see, you have a look at the pictures. You can see the venue, the suit, the wedding dress, and uh, various things. If you're interested in that kind of thing, so. Uh, yeah, I'm also feeling really weird wearing a ring. Like I don't usually wear rings, and it's just it's already feeling a bit like sort of itchy, you know, because it's like just something there that's not I'm not used to having. So it'll take a while to get used to, but um, yeah, 
There we go. That's um, so. Enjoy the pictures, and uh, uh, see you next time. I'm pretty hungover still, to be honest. I I was puking loads last night after I got in. Oh God! I just remember night last night as with horror. They had some. They had this cider on. It was just. It was like a flat cider. It was so drinkable. It was called. It was called Fiery Fox. I think, and it's a Welsh cider, and it was 6.6%, and it was absolutely delicious. It was like pop, it just you couldn't tell it was strong, and I was knocking that back, um, along with all the other beers. There was beers on that were like 8.8% .8 or something. Um, Haxon, I think, Wyland Brewery's Haxon, I think it was called. Very nice, but very strong, especially when you're trying to sample every booze in the pub. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I don't even know how I managed to walk out of the place, to be honest, but I was fucked. Very good night. Anyway, enjoy the pictures. See you next time. Saving ourselves.